Hi, this is Carrie Shell from On Point Quilter. In today's video tutorial, we're going to start a series that I'm entitling April Showers. And for the first lesson, we're going to focus on drafting the umbrellas for this particular quilt. Okay, I've opened Electric Quilt and I'm going to select New Project and I am going to call this one April Showers and I will select OK. And I will start by selecting Design a Block from Scratch. And in the Block Work Table, I'm going to select New Block Pieced Easy Draw Block. And for this one, I, in my Precision Toolbar, I'm going to select a block width and height of 4. Uh, I'm going to put snaps 4x4, four four, graph paper cells 4x4, four four, and snapping options snap to grid only. And then I'm going to use my line tool and I'm going to start by just drawing a diagonal line. And for the second line, I'm going to start in the upper right corner and I'm going to stop at the um, midway point of the bottom. And then I'm going to go to the color tab and I'm going to color this. and I will add that to the project sketchbook. Now for the next one, I'm actually going to do a variation on this particular block. So I am going to go to the Draw tab, and now I'm going to change my snaps to 16 by 16. And now what I will do is use the Line tool, and I am going to, at the quarter inch mark, draw a long vertical line. And then I'm going to go to the color tab and I'm going to color that. And this is going to be the uh, stick in the middle of my umbrella. And I'm going to add that to the project sketchbook as well. Now for the third one, I'm going to do a new block pieced easy draw block. And I'm going to start by just um, at the three and three quarters mark, use the line tool and draw uh, the long line. And then I'm going to draw a three quarter inch uh, folded corner. Now this will give a little bit of a handle to the umbrella stick. And so I'm going to go to the color tab and color that and add to the project sketchbook. Now I'm going to go back to the home and I'm going to select Design a Quilt from Scratch. And for this I'm going to select Horizontal and under the Layout tab I'm going to select 4x4 four four, and I'm going to put the block width and height at 4. And so I'm just going to type in the 4 and tab over to the next number, type in a num another 4. And I'm going to go to the Borders tab, and I'm going to delete the current border. And then I will go to the Design tab, and I'm going to find those blocks that I just did. And for that first one, I'm going to set it in these particular spaces. And I'm going to use the Flip tool, and then back to my Set Block. For this next one, I'm going to put it there. And then for my handles, I'm going to put it in those three spaces. So I'm going to go back to using Flip, and I'm going to flip that one. And I think that looks good. So now I'm going to go to my Fabric Tools, and I'm going to use the eyedropper, find this particular red, and I'm going to um, put it in these three spots, use the eyedropper, find the darker red, and put it in some of these alternate blocks as well. And then I can find the eyedropper for the sky and put it there. Now if you are going to piece this quilt, don't piece all of these uh, blank squares because there will be some uh, changes coming during the next week. So once I've got this done, I can add this to the project sketchbook. For additional tips and techniques, please subscribe to my weekly newsletter at www.onpointquilter.com. And while you're there, check out my other Electric Quilt 8 class offerings.